Yeah, and I don't know what came over me. I... Up there? In the drug dealer's house? I don't know, I just felt a rage overtake me and I... I let them have it with my bare hands and the tire iron. I've never felt... Never felt a rage like that before. I don't know, I felt almost like a, a beast or an animal and it was... It was exhilarating, I'll be... I'll be honest, I... Sort of want to do it again. Yes. But Dylan will have to control that rage that she feels. If she wants to blend in with normal society anyway. But still. We are a monster in the night. No longer are we afraid of the monsters, we are one. People are afraid of us. We would never have wandered round Santa Monica at this time of night before. But now it's like we have a new sense of freedom. We would never have wandered up little back alleys like this. Yet here we are. So let's use our newfound freedom and power to explore this city at night. Gimbal's prosthetics. Well, there's many people going to be needing his services if we have our way. We intend to hack off as many limbs as possible. Yes, indeed. Locked. Gallery Noir. Surely be locked as well. Yes. Santa Monica Suites, so that is um, Mercurio's place. We'll have to drop in there and see him. And let him know that we got the... Uh, what was it? The explosives. Seymour's. <laughs> Seymour's Coffee. Seymour's Little Shop of Horrors. Yeah, I really want to visit this asylum place. That looks cool. Very cool. Medical clinic. Tattoos and piercings. Yeah, here's our building above the pawn shop. Yes, indeed. What do we have? What do we have on the other side of town? Can we get to the other side of town? So I guess this is Main Street, right? Dylan thinks, I should probably know this by now, I've lived here for long enough. Or actually, have we just moved here? I kind of forget. Did the prince move us here? I missed that. How do we get to 2nd Street? This way? Yeah, I guess this is 2nd Street. The Asylum. Look at that. Foxy Boxes. <coughs> yes, indeed. I've seen a few of those in my time. Thanks, Dylan. 
Look at this, wandering up a dark alley with no... No fear. Megahertz computing. Blood bank. Oh wait, is this the clinic? Ah. I can go this way, I see. I see. So we're currently behind the asylum. Hello. An unattended victim. No, 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 no. Come back. Lovely evening. Yes, it is. Lovely evening to feast. Hello. What's the haps, bro? Yes, the haps is. I'd like to feed on you. Yes, indeed. Nice night out, huh? Well, it's quite wet, but yeah, it's okay. The diner. Oh, ho, 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 wait. Isn't that where Lily... Uh, isn't that where Lily and... Um, uh, was it the Habija? What's, what was his... What was his name? Thin Blood. E. Was E the Australian guy? I don't know. The smoke shop. Interesting. Is that open? Well, let's go see what we have in the smoke shop. Oh, yeah. I like this song. Ah, we saw that. Gruesome remains found on the pier. Police baffled. It's sort of a gentleman's club or, or what? Yes, who might you be? Hey, how you doing? Ah, doing fine. I guess smoking isn't enough for you, handsome. You got it. I hope you don't taste too strong a tobacco. Come here, I need to feed. All right, let's get our blood back. Oh, whoops. Uh, 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 oh, excuse me, excuse me, uh, Whoops! <laughs> I guess the beast... The beast, uh... The beast drew us in. Ah, whoops. Well, at least we got our blood back. How, how do we stop feeding? Uh... I thought it was E, but I guess it's not. Uh, well, the feed key is F, so I guess we press F to stop feeding? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I think we'll have to look that up. So what does that mean then? I lose some humanity. Okay. And I broke the law. What does that mean? Did we get hunted by... Police or no, oh, he doesn't seem to be caring too much. I guess we got away with it. Hey, honey, looking for a date? Uh, no thanks. I don't intend to pay for it. Thank you very much. What do we have here? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We're heading to the diner. We'll see if we can find this. Find this lily. That, that's closed. What do we have this way? 
Brother Salvage. The sewers are all muddied with a thousand lowly suicides. The end is here. Well, technically that's true of everyone at some point, I suppose. Bail bonds. Aha! We heard about this place. Oops. Alright, let's head into this diner. Maybe we can find this Lily character. Right, try not to kill people, please, Dylan. That's okay. Mr. Milton, you know who this is, and I do hope you realize it was still on for tonight. Meet me at the agreed upon location across from the bar by the underpass. Bring your associate, Mr. Durbin, as it is a two man job that I am proposing. Any luck to two of you are already underway, and I shall see you soon. Bye. That was an interesting phone call. Something I can help you with. Uh, chilly out here tonight, isn't it? I guess. Yeah. Everything okay? I don't see how that's any business of yours. Oh, okay. I didn't mean to intrude. Goodbye then. Weirdo. Ooh. Look at these. Fat bar, DD, fix, pounds, Mr. Goo Goo. Oh, these look good. Got any blood though? N and N's, Srittles. Yeah, something tells me they won't have any blood here. Lily, I presume? Oh, she is, she ain't talking. Ooh, wonder if they got any mirrors in here. Damn. Can't go in. What do you do if people need to go to the toilet? Do they just... Do they just piss on the floor or what? Alright. I wonder if she knows anything. What'll it be, honey? Ah, uh, yes. You, you ever seen any pale, kind of strange types in here late at night? Is that a trick question? Uh. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, what should we say? Ah. Uh, you ever see a couple in here a few months ago? Surfer guy and a pretty girl. Hmm, let me think. Oh, yeah. About four dozen a week. Damn, okay. Uh, any girls hanging out here? Pale girls? Pale girls? Huh, like the Fitzsimmons albino. Yeah, she hasn't been in here in ages. Maybe her. Should we really talk about drinking blood and thin bloods? Let's ask her. Have you ever heard the term thin blood? Thin blood? Sounds familiar. Is that one of those tropical diseases? Yes, kind of. Uh, try to remember now, where did you last hear it? Mm. I know I've heard that before. Maybe a kind of strange pretty girl said something about it recently. One of those pale ones that comes in. Oh, that girl. Nice girl. First decent human being I've seen in here for years. Not like all the junkies and crazies I normally see. Yeah, I remember her. Yeah, weird. She left a tip, but she didn't order a thing. Yeah, she looked so hungry, too. Just sat there all night with a full glass of water in front of her, talking about this and that. She seemed lonely, a little scared, so I let her stay in the booth until we closed. She left some stuff here. You seem to know her. Why don't you give it back to her if you run into her? Well, you're a very trusting lady, Doris, aren't you? Yes, I do know her. I know I want to talk to her anyway, put it that way. Yes, I'll be sure to do that, Doris. 
cucaracha. What did we get? Really? What did we get? Hopefully it was money. Item gained, Lily's key. A photo of a young woman. The message on the back of the photo reads, August 3rd, Santa Monica, Lily. Ah, she's on the beach. Okay, that doesn't really help us though. We know what she looks like. Purse left behind in the diner. Can we open it? Can't use it. August 3rd, Santa Monica, Lily. This doesn't really help us. Lily's key, now that does help us. But, where does she live? Can't see any details on it. It's our wallet. Blood pack, wooden steak, bail bond. Oh, we have a receipt for a bail bond. The bail bond was for one Rolf Totten. We could hand that in then. Astrolite, car stereo. Oh, we could sell that, I think. Ha, uh, where does Lily live? Where does she live? Where's our log? Thin blood. You have retrieved Lily's belongings from the diner. They consist of a photo, a key, and a bail bond. Ah, we got the bail bond from Lily's purse. Okay. Why don't we take that to, uh... What's his name? The bail bond guy. See if he can give us any details about that. Yes, indeed. And there's one more thing. There's one more thing. One more thing here. The Regent's Riddle. The Tremere Regent has invited you to his home in downtown Los Angeles. Ah, but we're not in downtown Los Angeles. We're in Santa Monica. Okay, we can't do anything about this. We saw a bloody murder scene on the pier, but we haven't been able to find anything else out about that. We'll go back to Mercurio, we'll go to this bail bond. One of the Thin Bloods believes everything you say. Sell him what he wants could make you some money. What did he want? Some unicorn blood, was it? We'll come back to him later. Let's go see this uh, bail bond guy. Wherever he... Wherever he... Aha, uh, uh -huh. where was he now? Ah... Uh, Dylan, you need to work on your memory skills, mate. Aha! Perfect. Look at that. Look at that. A and B kill Patrick's bail bonds. Let's see what this guy has to say, Kilpatrick. I don't care. I need to find him so he can find him. It's 250 grand of my money on the line here. Look, look, I'll talk to you later, okay? Let me know if you hear anything about either. Well, you've got a fun night of it, don't you? Ooh, look at those. Hi, Deb. This is uh, Vigo. Vigo. So. Search a national database for missing and wanted persons. Find information on your neighbours and co-workers. Can we switch this off? Yes. October. Oh, it's midnight. Look at that, midnight. Hello there. How you been? Yes, hi. Welcome to Kilpatrick 24-hour bail bonds. My name's Arthur Kilpatrick. How can I help you? Well, Arthur, you run this place, I assume? Yep, sure do. I'm a third-generation bondsman. Got a few employees, but I handle most every aspect of the business. Uh, I don't see any employees. I gotta have a few other bondsmen to keep the place open 24 hours. Plus a bounty hunter. 
I pull the graveyard shift because that's when all the crazy shit happens in Santa Monica. <laughs> yes, yeah, so we've noticed. Now, Santa Monica doesn't seem like a good place to be living. Well, my business ain't bad, I can tell you that much. Santa Monica's gone downhill. Used to be pretty nice, I guess. We do a higher volume now than we did a few years ago, but we gotta deal with a lot more bail jumpers and crap like that. Huh. Do many people jump bail? Of course. Goes with the business. Then you sick the bounty hunter on him. Ah, like Dog. Yes, Dog the bounty hunter. I see. Well, that's got to be an interesting job. You betcha. I used to do some bounty hunting back in the day. Takes a good solid set of brass balls. Uh, pardon the expression, Missy, but it takes balls to be a good bounty hunter. Huh. Well, the way that we were feeling today, with what we did at the drug dealer's house, I guess, we certainly feel like we have balls anyway, put it that way. Is the bounty hunter you have now any good? Yep, damn good. His name's Carson, and he's great at what he does when he wants to do it. I can't seem to find him now, though. He's pissing me off, to be honest. I need him to go find someone. Huh. Well, maybe I could find him for you. Well, I don't feel right cutting Carson loose just yet. We go way back. I knew his father, too. Tell you what, since I'm stuck here, why don't you go look for him? Just real quick. I'll pay you for your time. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, well, where should I look for him? Great, great. I suppose the first place you should look is his apartment in Santa Monica Suites. Apartment 1, I think it is. Maybe you'll find something there to let you know where he's got himself to. Here's a key card. That'll let you in. Aha. Well, we're going there anyway to meet Mercurio. Before I go, Arthur, can I ask you a question, please? Sure, honey. What is it? Don't honey me, mate. Uh, listen, uh... Have, have you heard about the murders in town? That's not what we want to ask about. We want to ask about the, the bond that we have. Um, well, have you heard about the murders in town? Yeah, they're saying there was a murder down by the pier, just like the one the other day down in Long Beach. Just vicious. Tore them up. They're saying it's a serial killer. And, uh, what are the cops doing about it? Well, typically when things like this happen, the cops ratchet up the patrols and start hauling in more suspicious types. Could be good for me. Yes, if you say so. I have a few more questions. Sure, honey, what is it? I told you, don't honey me. Santa Monica's really going downhill, isn't it? Hell yeah, I ain't complaining. I'm in a good position to watch it all just slide right down the tubes, you know what I mean? <laughs> yes. Yes, uh, why can't we ask about this bail bond? Sure, honey, what is it? I want to know about a few places in town, sure. What place you want to know about? Asylum, Gallery Noir. Yeah, okay, tell us about the asylum. Oh, you mean that club? We get drunk and disorderlies and drug bust out of there sometimes. Some fights. The owners run it pretty tight, though. See, who are the owners? You know, I'm not even sure. Couple of ladies. Sisters, I think. You don't see them around here too much. Huh. Well, thank you, Arthur. Goodbye. Yes. Uh... Oh, I wonder... Well, look, 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 look. I wonder. Got this bail bond. The bond is for Rolf Toten. Um. Don't really know how bail bonds work, to be honest. We don't, we don't really. We don't really have these where I'm from. Um, I wonder if we can look up information on this Rolf Toten. Maybe that can help us. Maybe that can help us find, uh. Uh, find Lily. Uh, available menus, yes. A to F, please. C bomb, M Bremer camp, V cleaver, F Kuget, V crumb, M Durban, uh, back. 
GTM C. Grady, M. Iberson, A. Kramer, C. Moore. C. Moore. He had that coffee shop, didn't he? What do we know about him? On written 10th of the 12th. No, it's, it's USA, isn't it? So it's 12th of the 10th. 12th of October. Public disturbance, noise, case, public disturbance. Oh. Is that us? Bond about 2000. 50 copies of console game. What? Oh, he put this as collateral. Okay. But I'm in for excessive talk and smack at the local arcade. Okay, I don't think that's the same Seymour as the other guy. Into R. B. Nilsson. O. Olsen. B. Pedroso. T. Perillo. S. Rhodes. S. to Z. This is what we're looking for. A. Schmidt. Our servers are Toten and I. Valentine. Right. Rolf Toten. Bond written 22nd of August, 03. Immigration. One about 15,000 type of bond collateral car. Oh, we put down a red Corvette. So how does how does the how does bail bond work? If you're in prison, you have a uh. If you if you. You have put down collateral and you get bailed out of prison and yeah. Uh, if you break your bail, you have to pay that amount of money or go back to jail. I I don't quite know how it works. Notes, go back to Germania, pal. We don't want the Euro in these parts. Oh. Okay. Rolf Toten is uh, German, more than likely. What else do we know about him, though? Nothing. Whoops. Nothing. Can we look at your computer, Arthur? Do you any different? One email, one unread email. Uh, do we want to hack this with him standing right there? I don't think so. He's not looking. Do we get in trouble for hacking this? Probably. I don't want to risk it. <laughs> not after what we did in that uh, cigar shop. So, right. You find a reference to Rolf Toten in Arthur's Crime Pier. His car is a red lightning bird 77. License reads Guy Coney. Perhaps you should find this car. Right, I've no idea what a lightning bird 77 is. I don't I don't know what kind of car that is. Um It's a 77, so it's probably it's some sort of classic. Uh, classic sports car, I would think. He read one. Registration, Guy Coney. Oh, should we check here, maybe? I don't think we can go into this place. Right, we'll head back to the apartments, right? And we'll go and visit Mercurio and we'll go and visit, um... We'll go and visit Carson. What we should probably do... Is check this, uh... Check this car park. I don't think so, buddy. You look shady. What are you waiting there for? What are you up to? Right. Let's try and find a, a red lightning bird. Red 77 lightning bird. That's a VW camper, right? How about that? Guy Coney! Huh. Police are right there. Is it open? Oh, it's open. Right, we already have a tire iron, so what is this? Come on, Dylan. A diary. This seems to be a woman's diary. 30th of April, 03. I met a guy today at the asylum. He's so beautiful. Oh my god. His name is Rolf and he's from Germany. European men are just so classy compared to boring California boys. 
He has to see me tomorrow night. I wonder if he's rich. He looks rich. I'm going to I'm going to go shopping tomorrow and pick up something that won't make me look like a big fat pig. Can't wait to see him. I wonder if he's rich. He looks rich. Well, I ain't saying she's a gold digger. But I think it's getting serious with Rolf. 21st of May. So they've been seeing each other for a month. He told me he wanted to give me something very special next week. And if it's what I think it is, it's about time. I thought Europeans were supposed to be less uptight about this sort of thing. Oh, no, I don't think that's what he wants to give you. I think he's going to give you the present that we got given uh, last night. 6th of June. Okay, so it's uh, a couple of weeks later. I woke up at 9pm today. That would be strange in itself, except I don't remember going to sleep last night. In fact, I don't remember anything last Saturday night when Rolf was over. 10th of June. I woke up late again. I haven't eaten anything in four days. I don't know what's wrong with me. 11th of June. Rolf came over last night. He said the reason I hadn't eaten anything was because I needed blood. Yeah, Rolf's, Rolf's turned her into a vampire. He said it was all I could eat now that I wouldn't feel hungry anymore if I drank some. He had a bag of it from the local blood bank. I tried to refuse, but I couldn't. What's happening to me? 26th of July. Rolf says he's going to leave soon. He said people are trying to force him out of the country. He didn't say anything about taking me with him. 22nd of August. It's now a month later. I had to bail Rolf out of jail today. He was arrested because his visa expired. He looks frightened. I'm afraid he's going to leave. 7th of December. Wow. Wait. Yeah. 7th of December. I haven't seen or heard from Rolf since the night I bailed him out. I don't know what to do. I thought he cared about me. Why did he do this to me? 15th of April, so it's a long time ago. I talked with this guy I met in the Surfside until 5 this morning. When I told him I had to go, I felt like Cinderella. He seemed like a prince. Met that guy from the Surfside again. He has no idea who I am. 24th of April. Brought E, the guy from the Surfside, back to my apartment last night. He said he's going back to Australia in a few days now that the tournament's coming to an end. I don't want him to leave. I never felt this way about someone before, not even Rolf. E kissed me last night and I couldn't stop myself from biting into his neck. I know the feeling, mate. But I drank too much and I gave my blood to save him. Uh, when I explained it all to him, he said he never wanted to see me again. What have I done? I haven't been able to feed since that night with E. I'm afraid of what will happen. I remember Rolf brought blood from the blood bank. Maybe if I can sneak in, I can grab a few bags and get out before anyone catches me. 5th of... 8th of May. Wow, she actually does care about this E guy, doesn't she? What's her next clue? The blood bank? Find out something about her in the blood bank? We've located Lily Journals. Her last entry mentions a plan of hers to break into the local blood bank. That seems like a bad idea. Yeah. That seems like a bad idea. But I guess we could go in. I guess we could go in and see what we could find. Yes, indeed. Where's Seymour's? Is that it there? We are moving! Seymour's coffee shop will be moving to a new location on the main boulevard of Hollywood. Dear customers, please visit us there soon. Okay. Good to know. Alright. The medical clinic. Isn't the blood bank in the back? Isn't this the blood bank here? Yes, it is. Alright. Well. Let's go drink some blood. I mean, let's go investigate the blood bank and find out Lily. Uh, and then drink some blood. Oh.